Hello, I'm Ty Mason from the DiabetesCouncil.com, researcher, writer, and I have type 2 diabetes. Today I'm going to answer the question, is pineapple good for diabetes? But before we get into that, make sure you download my free diabetes management book, which also includes a diabetes grocery shopping guide, foods to eat and avoid, by clicking the link below. Now we've discussed this in other videos, but just because you have diabetes, doesn't mean you have to give up fruit. Fruit is an essential part of a healthy diet, even for those of us with diabetes. What we need to do is be smart about the fruit that we choose to eat and how much. So what about the pineapple? Well, at first glance, it doesn't look very good. The pineapple's makeup is 86% water, 14% carbs. They can be also very high in sugar. But let's not give up on the pineapple yet. We always have to look at the whole picture of a food before we dismiss it or accept it. Now one factor we must look at in deciding whether or not a food is good or bad for those of us with diabetes is the glycemic index, or GI. The lower the GI, the better it is for us. In other words, foods with a lower GI have less impact on our blood sugar. Now fresh pineapple has a GI of 59. This makes it a medium impact food. Foods with a GI of 50 to 55 or less are considered low impact, while those at 70 or more are high. Now, something else I think we need to look at that is becoming more and more popular, uh, other than the glycemic index, is the glycemic load. Now, this basically measures the likelihood of a food raising your blood sugar after you eat it. Now that's an easy calculation and I have the formula on the screen for you right now. The glycemic load is found by simply multiplying the glycemic index by the amount of carbohydrates per serving and then dividing by 100. The pineapple has a medium GI but its glycemic load is only 7. That makes it very very low and isn't likely to cause a large increase in your blood sugar levels if you eat just one serving. So. Is pineapple good for diabetes? Well, yes it is, as always, in moderation. But, I ask you to be very careful. These numbers are for raw, fresh pineapple. If you go to the store and you buy a can of pineapple expecting it not to affect your blood sugar, well, you're going to be surprised. If choosing canned pineapple, you must be sure it's either packed in its own juices, which is preferable, or water. Do not get pineapple that's packed in heavy syrup. The amount of sugar in some canned pineapple is triple the amount of that of fresh. Now, I hope this answered your question, is pineapple good or bad for diabetes? Don't forget to get your diabetes management book by clicking the link in the description box below. And as always, let me know if you have any other diabetes-related questions. I want to thank you for watching. I'm Ty Mason.